everybody, this is Sleeved Mel 2015, and I am here with a really good friend, Val, Valerie. She is from her channel, The Neighbors, and she is getting the gastric bypass surgery here real soon, hopefully real soon. Yes. So I got a tag from a couple people from YouTube. One of them was Alan VSG, and he tagged us in a... I believe it's called the weight loss surgery tag. Something sim simple. Otherwise, I'm just naming it that. Well, it sounds like a good name to me. Okay. So there's 14 questions, so let's try to get through this really quick. Okay, number one. When did you start gaining weight? I would say I started gaining weight in August of last year when I started having... I had both feet operated on, I had a bladder surgery, and I had a shoulder surgery, and I became stagnant. Wow, that sounds kind of like my story. Mine is, I got in two car accidents, had kids, had two C-sections. I just ended up not being active. I was in a lot of pain all the time, chronic pain all the time. And so I just started gaining weight. Not only that, I worked full time at fast food restaurants, so that didn't help uh, either. So. Yeah that kind of made me start going downhill so it was about 10 i would say about 10 11 12 years ago around that time i started gaining weight so number two what is was your heaviest weight mine was like 190 well actually when i was pregnant with megan i was 210 pounds okay without being pregnant i was 198 okay with being pregnant I was 245 pounds. I gained 30 pounds with Caden, with my oldest son. And then, um, not being pregnant, I went back down to 220, and I've been at 220 for eight years and just never gone down. Well, that's good that you stayed at 220, though, and you didn't go up. Yeah, you know? that's a good thing. Yeah. Um, number three, what diets have you been on? Oh, what diets haven't I been on? I say the same thing. <laughs> The one that I was on many, many years ago, after I had Megan and I did lose all my weight, was Weight Watchers. Okay. I, I've been on SlimFast, Weight Watchers, Atkins. I've had a, a nutritionist. I've had personal trainers. Yeah. Just didn't go I, away. I, the main two I did that actually worked was Weight Watchers and Jenny Jenny Craig. Oh, yeah. I forgot about Jenny Craig. Yeah. I didn't do did it, either one of them work for you? Any nope. of them work? I lost five pounds, but like in most of my videos, I fluctuate. I talk about that all the time because the first five days on the pre-op diet, I gained weight. So it was, <laughs> I've always fluctuated and none of them really helped. I instantly gained weight back. Yeah. Number four, is your goal a certain size or a number on the scale? I would say mine is neither. Oh, really? Yes. Mine is how I feel. That's great, yeah. That especially for you because she, uh, if you guys don't know, if you haven't seen her journey, she's been dealing with a lot of sicknesses like gastroparesis and stuff. So it's, it's really uh, difficult to uh, do things. So it would be really cool to see how, you, how her journey goes. Um, for me, it would be both. I wanna see the scale go down. I want to see my size go down, but I think it's more of a non-scale victory I'd be more proud of. You know, the the loose clothes, the crossing of the legs easily, the sleep apnea gone. So it's kind of like things like that that I would um, that would be my goal. What was your favorite food before we started our journeys? Uh, my favorite food was lobster. Oh, I love lobster. My favorite food was crab. The king crab. Ooh, yeah. Garlic sauteed. I would have to say any type of, like... Seafood. Like, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yep. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> what is your favorite food right now? Being uh, on the pre-op diet. I, I'm eating a lot of hard-boiled eggs. Okay. Um, I don't have a favorite food because I'm not eating. <laughs> Water. So, yeah. <laughs> No, uh, during the pre-op diet, my favorite was um, soups. I love soups. I can eat soups all day. I'm a big, huge fan of soups. Give me any kind of soup. I love it. So, what food do you refuse to give up? That's a hard one. 
Um, that is a hard one. Um, I'm going to have to say my lobster, my seafood. And that's the good thing about having weight loss surgery is that you can eat seafood because it's very high in protein and um, it's a, a slider food. It can go down easily. You do have to always remember though. Chew 30 times. Oh my lord. I am not patient for this kind of stuff. <laughs> I'm going to have to be forced to be though. Number eight, how do you reward your accomplishments? How will you reward your accomplishments? I did not reward myself for any accomplishments throughout the classes and everything I went through. But if any of you know what Pyramid Catalog is, they have some awesome clothes. And my husband said he's going to let me get some nice dresses Aww, and stuff. that's sweet. I've never heard of it, so I'll have to look Ooh, at it. Oh, yeah, we'll go online and look at it after this. Yes, well, my people are like, oh, let's be honest to yourself. Because, you know, at first I was like, my rewards would be me losing weight. That would be a reward. Or me feeling better. That would be a reward. But let's get real. This mama likes shopping. <laughs> And I like clothes, so that will be my reward. New yeah, clothes. I don't like going shopping. I'll shop online. I shop have, online yeah, too. Yeah. Yep. Pyramid. You gotta check out Pyramid. Okay. I'm telling I will. you. Okay. Uh, number nine. What will you do when you hit your goal? We're gonna have a dance party. Hello. We're gonna put on some loud music and party like there's no tomorrow. I think we should do a Vegas trip. That is the best idea I've heard ever. Woo! We're going to Vegas. Vegas, baby! Okay, number 10. What diet are you following now? Go ahead. Go ahead. <laughs> okay, I am on a full liquid pre-op diet right now, and I have lost almost 12 pounds. But that was only three days, but then I was on a pre regular pre-op diet for 14 days. I am on a pure protein diet right now, and I went through a 13-week gastric bypass class because of my insurance. You have to do that. And I have lost, I started at 187, and I am at 178 right now. Woo, woo! So, what is that? Okay, number 11. What is your favorite body part? Um, right now? Yeah. My hair. Your hair is very pretty. I love I your just, hair. I just recently got my hair done. But that's not a body part. Oh. Um. So you can't you can't get away with this one. <laughs> um. My my tattooed arm. There you go. Your sleeve. She's got the sleeve. I'm getting the uh, <laughs> sleeve. different type of sleeve. Yeah. Um. My favorite body part are my toes. I got cute little toes. You do. I can't you, see have, them. you have cute toes. I and, like my and, toes. And I like your paint, your toenails. Thank you. Color. I'd show you, but I can't lift up my leg to show you guys, so we don't need to do that. She's got cute toes. Thank you. Uh, number twelve. What are your non-scale goals? Wait, didn't we already talk about that? Not, not our non-scale goals. Well, my non-scale. Kind of. Well, yeah. Well, we'll reintroduce this thought again. My non-scale goals is from couch. To 5K run. She got it right! <laughs> Mine is just to be healthier, live healthier, be able to get up and go hiking again like yep. I used to. I be hiking. able, Yeah. Be able to go and do stuff without feeling like I am going to die. Um, and to, one, one of the things I didn't mention after my surgery, if it does what my doctor says it's supposed to do for me, I am looking at getting off of at least four of my medications that I have That's been a great on yeah. for years. Years. Yeah. And that scares the crap out of me. Yeah, because you're used to it. Yeah. So the first night I'm going to be going to bed and not having to take those medications, it's going to be like, oh my gosh, what am I going to do? <laughs> you know. Yeah. Uh, number 13. What makes losing weight hard for you? <sighs> I'm a stress eater. Yep, me too. I, I'm, I'm actually a lot of type of eaters. I'm a social eater. 
I'm a stress eater. I'm a bored eater. Um, I eat. Food is my addiction. I love food. I love to cook. I love food. I can eat everything except for raw seafood. I'm going to do it for them. like oysters. Mm -hmm. Not happening. Sushi? No, nope, not sushi. Can't do sushi. But otherwise, I'll eat everything else on the face of the planet except for bugs. That too. <laughs> <laughs> Last but not least, would you ever consider weight loss surgery? No. 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 Not in a million years. No. <laughs> not gonna do it ever mm -mm. my surgery my surgery is tomorrow Thursday July 2nd so if you're watching this afterwards I've had my surgery so yep I've considered it I don't have my surgery date quite yet um, I just finished the classes they said it could be anywhere from two to four months but they already sent me for my EKG so that's a good sign yep and they said if I don't hear from them within six weeks, to call them. I hope it's much sooner than six weeks. Me too. Ugh. It's a long time to wait. But you know, it's coming. Okay. That's yep. the important thing. Yep. Okay. Okay, guys. Thank you so much for watching our 14 question weight loss surgery tag. This is Val once again. She has her own daily vlog on her channel called The Neighbors. And she does a weekly update on her weight loss surgery and her pre-op diets what she's doing so make sure if you haven't yet go on over to her channel and subscribe to the neighbors watch their daily vlogs watch their weekly vlogs they have some amazing footage i love watching them and i uh, hope you guys go on over and subscribe thank you guys for watching we'll see you guys next time ciao Bye. are you sure